Good evening and welcome back to Timberborn, where we are doing a couple of odd things. I have put some exposure down here because I was originally going to blow this up and put more trees in here because we needed more logs. And then we're going to put some trees over here instead and now we're full of logs again. So everything is awesome. Yeah, okay. Uh, we're going to do that then. Um, this is slowly filling up with the things we need. So yeah. Um, I need to get loads of loads of uh, metal blocks in there. We need um, 180 metal blocks for two of those, and we currently have uh, not enough. So, uh, but the other thing as well that um, I mentioned many episodes ago and just didn't get around to doing, um, and uh, that's uh, yeah. So uh, uh, crispy um, said about putting in monuments, and I was like, yes, we should put in some monuments around just to give us a bit of a boost, and they never did. And forgot about it so we're gonna do that we can do that right now we're gonna put a lemon monument in right here this will cover all the houses but don't yes and then we're gonna build a platform up here just so we can get up onto it in fact i'm not gonna put it there i'm gonna move it over by one so we actually can get up here to do our things we could put the flame of unity down but that does require plank um planks and um metal blocks with a word I'm after um, and uh, we don't have uh, oh I should unpause these two these probably need running again at some point um, we, we don't really have metal blocks I'm trying to save the metal blocks because I need 180 because I want to blow up this here um, and uh, put in metal blocks put in the two platforms here but to do that I need to shut these down I need to turn these off and shut them down so yeah so we need to we need to do that we need to do that um i'm also going to i think it doesn't really matter over there yeah that's fine then. um i am also building in here um we're filling up some uh we're filling up this here and then we're going to fill up this here and let this drain down of uh, bad water with our um with the dirt things um this is the height that we want to go at so i am filling to the correct height anyway um, but I want to try and get hold of one of the underground ruins sooner rather than later because we can't get into here because this is kind of awkward because of the bad water and uh, we're running out of um, of uh, scrap so I don't want to end up running out of metal completely so uh, yeah trying to trying to figure that one out here should be fine should be fine and then we can get this going and this will almost be ready um, also um, thank you very very much to those who commented on the last episode as well um uh, uh chris vega uh mentioned about that the new update because the way the water changes they no longer water wheels no longer block water so the flow goes through without it so i don't worry about this filling overfilling and uh, overpouring. so yeah but i'm still gonna leave these here because it doesn't really matter at all so that's fine um also um the uh um i was saying about building things down we wanted to build ladders coming up here and doing things uh from this point here they could build all of the all of the vertical power line down to the floor there they could do that very easily so um yeah so long as we get up to here at some point we can do that i will want to have things go up here because we still have stuff to build up here and do things so um you know we still so i will we'll put um a uh a ladder on this side going up to it from wherever we need to go to i'm not exactly sure where we're going to go to we can find the middle of the map that'd be nice that's easy that's easy with this button here um so um uh, we know the map goes up to 127 so halfway should be 63 which would be there well, it's 120, so halfway is actually 63 and 64 um it's these two here but we'll go with 63 so that means this tile here this tile here is halfway between the two so this is where i want to probably put the ladders so let's do that let's do that let's put the ladders here and i'm gonna turn them around and face them away from us so there we go Boom. turn that back off again that's uh for them um, shift alt and x to bring up the debug menu and then you just uh open the cursor one it tells you where the cursor is gives you the height and everything so um, yeah, and then they can build that, and um, that will allow them to get up to the top here, which would be awesome. We also have this row at the bottom that does isn't really going to be used for anything at all. So, um, but they can get access to the bottom as well. 
for whatever reason um, wants to. Um, I could have done this as single pl uh, double platforms I uh, know I couldn't do double platforms I wouldn't be able to reach above so yeah so we need to do that we need to have it as single platforms for that to all work so yeah okay okay so um, how are we doing how are we doing dirt is empty because this is not uh, not running enough to f to keep up with this here let's explode all these out here shall we let's do that so I'm going to um, I'm going to cut off this road here and that should stop everybody every beaver coming along here No, they're still coming. Why are you still coming? Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Cool. Right. Um, I also realised I want to put in a single explosive here. And then we want to take out this here, put an explosive here, and then we want to blow this up here just to get it down. Um... Uh, probably want to blow up some more along here anyway but we'll, we'll, we'll get to that that's fine that's fine probably should have blown up some more on there but um i suppose if we are running we don't have any we don't have any we're trying to get this done over here as well so but um metal metal is what i need i need to save 180 metal um minimum 180 metal so we can build those two platforms. actually we need more than that because we also need to fill in the uh thing so 180 plus 10 uh 20 so 200 we need 200 metal Bad tide has started. Oh no! Right. Get rid of those. Got another explosive in there. Let's detonate this out here. Ready? Go. Oh. Ah, always time to do what I save. Always. There we go. Right. And then we'll blow up this one, this one, this one. This one, and this one. And this one, and this one. We go look at that look at that okay and then we just need to put in two there to lower that down that'll be fine get rid of this um oh i deleted the uh the rubble oh well what a shame what a shame doesn't really matter um so the road will come out along here we'll come down here and then we'll come along to there there we go that's going to reconnect that system up there that'll be cool and we've got more space for trees and things now so yep yeah. um i did seal that off before so uh the water, all the bad water is going that way so we're getting close we're getting close to what we need to do I need to seal this off as well um which is going to be easy we just seal those two off not a problem at all um and then we will have to just put in the uh the power it's basically the, diverting the um the bad water and then putting a couple of power balls in maybe just the ones here um and then we'll run a power line down of this one here um and we'll have to move our thing but I, I might temporarily connect this side up to here um somehow just just temporarily connect this side up to something here so we can um uh, just still have power running through our system because these obviously are going to stop working at some point too uh, let's prepare for that now then shall we so if i put in a platform there and there that'll work and then we get some power going so we'll have a line like that then we'll have a up shaft then we'll have a vertical shaft go up 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 and up and up again yep up again and then we have it face that way then we we'll have to put in a temporary one there with a single line across like that and then we put in the large wheels on top of here well i need to remove right, is this complete over here this is complete over here so we can remove this here um apparently the um this uh when you remove path and you should remove the bottom piece as well you should take out the um you know, that apparently that has been fixed in a a recent patch so um, what Zuigi was saying about the whole if you put a path in and you remove it it's a pain to do but um that has been fixed now so that should be good um also i've just realized something because well, if i put the ladder here that's going to cause us our batteries to not work on this point here but i kind of have to i can't see any other place i can put a battery but i put stairs in there to get up there there just there is just no other place to do it so um 
Maybe we'll skip batteries at the center point here. And uh, then we'll have the batteries run either way. So, yeah. Uh, so it's going to end up coming in. It's going to be one short of this end. And it's one short of this end. So that is kind of the center of the entire run anyway. So, yeah. Yeah. So we'll just miss the batteries out in the center here. We'll just run a power line across between the two. So between these two, we'll run a power line. We could put one battery in, but we'll just... Uh, I think for now what I'm going to do as well I'm just going to run a power line across there like that um, because we don't have the metal to put in the batteries yet they are something we want to do but we're going to do this we get four power wheels that should be enough to run our system this is connected to here which will connect vertically down to here uh, you can't do that because you obviously can't reach up to there which is a bit of a pain um, let us disconnect this here in fact no we still want to go in there don't we for the minute yeah so this should be fine they should be able to build all of these by walking down here and reach up to that one there they can reach up one level so they can stand here and build that one and stand here and build that one and stand here and build that one so we should be fine for that um it's just this here they're not building because obviously there's no way for them to get up to it which uh is fine is fine Let's um let's remedy that by putting in a staircase like that. That means they can get to here, which means they'll be able to build this as well. But that'll work for us. Also, they can get up on top and run along here as well and build things so they can go either direction. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. Okay. Okay. Um right, so we can detonate this one out. Pop. Reconnect the road. That will let this start running again, which is awesome. Um, this is almost done. Yep, yeah, where are we? 259, so... Okay, how are we for scrap? 383, we're actually going up on scrap, so... Our six ones here are actually running up on scrap, so that's fine, so... Yeah, but you're going to run out of scrap fairly soon. Hopefully this gets done before that happens there, so... Okay, okay, so... They got, they're building, they should start building things here, so this will be fine. So we'll build this here, we'll get this built up here and sort it out. We'll get uh, 200 and a little bit metal blocks in. Try and put down some more explosives. Um, and build the two here and seal off the end and then just have this pour into this side. Should be difficult. Yeah, shouldn't be difficult at all. And uh, yeah, okay, so we'll be back uh, in a moment. right i think we are ready to go all of the power light, power wheels have been connected and running well they're plugged in um i've also added lots of things up on top of here i extended this up to to get to the roofs and we had access to the roof here anyway so we've added some more clock towers we've added some roofs and braces and things all around so now we've got an average of 19 well-being which means all our beavers are now up at 40 percent happiness uh, life expectancy sorry um so that means we are going to be 114 beavers per pod uh, 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 13 times 14 is 182 beavers we're going to go up to so we probably need to put some more houses in don't we okay okay however we do have 300 metal blocks which is awesome so let's do the thing shall we let's see it off this one just see it back closing then. But um, see it off this one. Oop. There we go. Let this drown out or drain out. I should say not drown out. Drain out. We just need to connect this up here, but hopefully this will drain out, and then this will drain a little bit out here. It's um, yeah, it should actually drain out this one. So then we can seal this off. Um, not that it needs to be sealed off now because the water's the bad water's going to run this way. So, okay, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see if this works. We'll see if this works. Go faster, go faster, game. Go, 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 go. Drain that out there. Oh, oh, okay. it is, it is drained. It is drained. Awesome. Okay, so let us explode this. And explode this. 
pop, 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 pop. There we go. And then we can put in this guy and this guy, and they're on the right places. Yes, they are. And then we can put in levies. Um, I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to do this one here. Um, there's not going to be a power wall there. There will be a power wall here, so I want that one sealed off. So um, maybe like that and have the four come in that way. Yeah, have this, have it pour into four here, which means we're going to have to seal off that one and that one. We're also going to have to seal off this one here as well, which I might do with a... Uh, uh, yeah, we need to blow up around this and change this and do things with it, but that's going to be again later. We're just going to get this kind of running for now, so that'll be fine. Um, let's just use a levy and block that off this side as well. Um, that'll be all right. Run a path all the way down. Uh, oh, you built it all the way down. Awesome. Uh, and then we're going to have to do impermeable flooring um, and on that bit there as well. Yeah, I think that'll work. I might want to go for five wide with this. But we'll go. We'll try four to start with, and we'll see how it works. We'll see how it works. So, you build all that. You get that built. That'll be fine. Um, this should start draining out. Oh, it's not going to drain out because obviously. Yep. Yep. Okay. Well, rather than connect this up, then I'm going to leave it separate because more edge area means it should. Um, uh, it should um, moisture transfer faster. Um, I could also just block a channel along here and um, let the uh, the stuff drain out. But um, I'll leave it. Or I could put some pumps in and pump it dry. Um, seeing as none of these are going to get any work anymore, you are completely redundant now. So remove all of you. Let's put a pump in over here. Just the one. We'll just put the one in. Um, add water pump. We'll put it. Uh, there, you can go right down to the edge there. Bump. Let's uh, take out those two lonely ones there. Also, we should probably get rid of these guys. Let's um, modish these, get those being done there. That build you. You can then pump out this area here. It will run dry pretty soon, I would have thought. We then need to put in our um, add water pumps over here, uh, which won't be a problem um, because we can just build them in there soon. I'm just going to leave it like it is for the minute because right now we don't actually have access to over here because of how this works. So we're coming along here, along here, down here. That's a long way to go. So we do still need it though because we need more explosives being done. So we've got 69 explosives. Nice, but not nice enough. Um, Okay, let's uh, just get on with this. You've got to just get on with this, basically. Uh, where's the uh, where's the pathway? Where's the road? Yeah, so on the road all the way up. Actually, get access up here to do this. That'd be useful. And then get all of our guys doing that. You can. Oh, you're full. That's okay. That's because you're full because we don't actually have any power right now. So yeah, bad time has started. This is fine. This switches over automatically. So, oh, you're going to build. Oh, you're fine. You do that. That's not a problem. It's not a problem. Okay. Now. Does it, is this, is this going to work? I don't see any reason why it shouldn't work. I need to get rid of that and put in a levy here. Hmm? Oh, I've got a pebble floor on top. <laughs> Oops. Oops. I have to get rid of this one as well. Don't do that. So this this is done. This is done. Okay. Let them build this first. levy in here I'm going to remove the road no road yes Oop. 
Nope. Okay. Will this work? Will this work? I don't know. I don't know. Might need to do a little bit more work around the edges here. It might be too much for it, but we will find out in a moment. This is built. This is connected. This is running. Okay. Okay. One last, one last double check. So everything is sealed. Everything has permeable floor on it. Impermeable floor on it. Everything is sealed. Everything is sealed. Everything is fine. Okay. Okay. So let's open both of these at the same time and see what happens. Here we go. Run at normal speed. Run at normal speed. So it's going to fill. It's going to start pouring down to here, which is awesome. That'll work fine. Okay, it looks like it's working. Um. Ooh, it's very full. It's very full. We are, of course, squeezing it into too wide gap. Oh dear. Oh dear. It's it's very full. It's not overflowing. Oh, it is raising. It is raising. Uh oh. Uh oh. That worries me. But stay there. Stay there. Don't go up any further. Stay there. Okay. Okay. That is that is very a very very full um two way channel very full so um yeah but it does look like it's working uh we've not got we've got obviously bad uh, underground because um uh but we haven't got any uh not sure why there's bad water at the bottom of those that's weird just transfer through there so yeah okay but um, there you go the power wheels are a spinning doing their thing got 2000 power coming through them which is enough to run this whole shebang yep um supplies 2000 demand is 1920 so yep awesome okay okay um it then pours down here and uh, is filling this okay that's exactly what we wanted so that's good that's good Right, it's interesting how it pulls. It sort of starts here, so it starts going down. I wonder if this will fill up even further as time goes on. So it does look like it is. It does actually look like it is. It is raising. Yeah, it's slowly raising. So I think this is going to slowly raise up, and and be full like all the way down. Really got to keep a. Oh no, it's overflowing. It's overflowing. It's overflowing. Okay. So two is not enough. Two wide is not enough. We are overflowing. Um, I don't know where that's going to lead to. Uh, it's going to fill the holes down there for the minute, isn't it? So yeah, two wide's not enough. Not enough. We could close one of these guys. Which is weird because one, one wide was enough here. Uh, oh, but then again, it's too deep, isn't it? No, it's only one deep. One wide is enough here, it's only two. That's weird. That is weird. That is weird. This is only one wide, and it was never overflowing along this. Hmm. Maybe it just needs to balance. Maybe maybe equilibrium needs to be to hit with it for it to balance a bit. So it needs to do a bit of overflowing to do things so. But um if I drop that down, this the power should dramatically drop. But yeah. Let's reopen that. Let's see. You are filling here. You obviously have five outlets, so this should never uh, overflow uh, because this has got five outlets and no two inputs, so that's not a problem at all. Yeah, yeah. I think okay. We're gonna we're gonna have to just let this go for a bit and see whether it 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 balances and it works fine. Um, if it doesn't, then we'll have to come up with a better solution. Maybe like a little, a little off flow to the edge of the map there. Um, that just causes that. See, the water's dropped. Um, it's now going to raise again. So yeah. So I think this just needs to be left running. 
needs to be left running for a while so it can it can reach equilibrium uh, hopefully balance fine um if any bad water does pour out underneath here it's only going to pour out to here um and then ends up back in this channel anyway so or off the map to go off the map actually so not all that fussed about it yeah not worried about that no okay cool 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 so there we go our bad water aqueduct is running um it's now actually dropped down a lot hmm hmm if uh it has just dropped down a lot. It's no longer. Maybe opening both of them at the same time was a bad idea. Back to 2000 power, which is where we were. No, maybe, maybe just backed up a little bit. No, I don't know. It seemed, it seemed odd to me that the um, the water level started dropping after these come along. Um, but they've found through, so. And, well, they're both open. They're both flowing. I don't see the water level raising anymore. Stable. So, uh. Cool. Okay, there we go. We have. We have that sorted and done. Uh, we have run out of scrap metal. That's concerning. Uh, because we need scrap metal. Hopefully, you can pump out all this and we can get the uh, underground room going here and we can get access to these as well. So, um. Yeah, we do have we do have uh 500 scrap still left and um 141 metal planks and we don't need any metal planks for this this is working now which is awesome so um yeah happy days happy happy days okay 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 this seems to be working here as well cool so i think we shall leave this episode here with a working flowing aqueduct which is awesome Awesome. We just need to blow up stuff around it and change some things underneath it to make it work better. So, uh, or look better. So, yeah. Oh, thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed this one, and I hope to see you again in the next one. And until then, as always, have fun.